Warsaw with you. What y'all doing, folks? It's your man back again. We're on Bumpus TV. We bumping out here. But listen, everybody. I just want to get everybody. I just want to just let everybody understand. We're going to break this fight down. Okay? Like I said, I'm going to be on multiple. I'm going to be on multiple times. They took the live away from your boy. It's okay. You can take my live. I still got my people. My 20 people rocking. We rocking and we going to never stop shocking. All right. So we going to keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? So let's get into this Keith Thurman, Manny Pacquiao fight. Keith Thurman and Manny Pacquiao. The old legend versus the uh, young hungry lion. I mean, I... But uh, let's break it down. Pacquiao, bottom line, he going to make that 147 easy, too. He going to make that 140. He going to come in at 145. Watch. Watch what I say. Comes in at 145. Keith Thurman's going to come in at one. He's going to try to show that he can get down that low. And that is probably going to be a downfall. He wants to prove. I hope he comes in at 147 flat, you know, to give him every single advantage possible. But I know Keith Thurman, he likes to be a little safe. He comes a little bit under 446.5 or something. Something safe. And, uh, yeah, they're going to have a fight. They're going to get in that ring and they're going to bust it out. And I'm going to tell you what's going I'm going to tell you one scenario that's going to go this way. Pacquiao gets in there. Everybody's hyped because he knows the busy big fight, big money coming, you know. He's going to get in there going to not be aggressive and it's going to be a very feel out rounds not, not, not even feel out rounds it's going to be they're very good at adapting both of them so I think Pacquiao is going to be pushing Thurman forward yeah yeah Pacquiao is coming forward which favors Pacquiao and I think that when Thurman sees the Thurman's going to counter. You got to understand that. He's going to be countering. And those are going to be thunderous countering shots. Like, us, us, us. You know how Keith Thurman does. He's going to be throwing them super bombs on the way back when he's backstepping. And I'm telling you, this is exactly how the fight's going to go. But the pivotal point, the pivotal point is when we get into about the fifth and sixth rounds. And it's strange to see that the younger guy has less conditioning than the older guard. Now, I'm not going to say that's how it's going to be. Hopefully, he understands it. Now, maybe he sees this video. But Keith Thurman, work on that stamina because you know Keith Thurman throws bomb, 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 bombs, 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 bombs. And you know in the second half of the fight, it's run time. You know, ain't no nothing wrong with it. No, definitely not knocking that. It's the smartest, the smartest thing to do to move around the ring and conserve energy. And then if you have to throw bombs, so be it, but you gotta understand when you're fighting a certain type of fighter like Manny Pacquiao, where there's no, there's really no time off. He's coming at you. You're gonna have to put out a lot of punch output. Like it's gonna have to be a war for you to win, Keith. So what I'm saying around the sixth, seventh round, I think that's when he's gonna get tired. He's gonna get hurt. He's gonna get knocked down because, well, he might able to stay he might be able to stay upright but he's gonna he's gonna show he's gonna show some weakness and some vulnerability and he's gonna have to come back and I think he's gonna be a back and forth type round but I think around that happens maybe around the eighth or ninth round we're looking at okay that little back and forth they picked up I don't know if Keith Thurman is gonna have the gas to keep on going with Manny Pacquiao and either he's gonna quit not quit. He's not going to quit. But he's going to get either put down. And when I say quit, I don't mean quit like I'm not fighting. He'll be, he might still be in the ring, but if he's down, he's down, you know. And um, that is what I'm thinking is, uh, I'm not going to say that's what I think is happening, but that is definitely a very plausible way. But the thing is, this fight is 50-50, right? 50-50 means that I can go the other way. And um, we'll talk about that in the next video. The next video will be my breakdown on round by round of how I think 
it can go the other way. It's 50-50. I got to, hey. And then after that, I'm going to give you my perspective on how I think it will go. So stay tuned.